Trump is pissed, he just asked Tillerson to do unimaginable after Tillerson failed Trump bad. It has been rumored for a long time that Secretary of State Rex Tillerson is on thin ice with President Trump. First he failed to get China on our side with North Korea, then he failed to even try to swing Congress on Russia. But wait, it gets even worse. Turns out Trump was really upset about the awful thing Tillerson said about him on Fox just yesterday. Trump ordered Tillerson to a private lunch to finish this once and for all. This whole thing came up when Chris Wallace asked Tillerson on Fox Sunday if Tillerson thinks people doubt Trump's values. All Tillerson could muster was a measly, the president speaks for himself, Chris. I'm itself when any terrorist organizations or countries that do. That's what winning looks like. Uh, finally, and I've got a little over a minute left, uh, the controversy over uh, the racial protests in Charlottesville and the president's response to it has become an international issue. Uh, a UN committee this week criticized the Trump administration for, quote, its failure at the highest political level to unequivocally reject and condemn the racist violent events and demonstrations. And here was the president in Phoenix this week talking more about the media than he was about the neo-Nazis and the Klan. Here he is. The only people giving a platform to these hate groups is the media itself and the fake news. Does that make it harder for you to push American values around the world when some foreign leaders question the president's values? Uh, Chris, we express America's values from the State Department. We represent the American people. We represent America's values, our commitment to freedom, our commitment to equal treatment of people the world over, and that message has never changed. And when the president gets into the kind of controversy he does and the UN committee responds the way it does, it seems to say they, they begin to doubt our, whether we're living those values. I don't believe anyone doubts the American people's values or the commitment of the American government or the government's agencies to advancing those values and defending those values. And, and the president's values? The president speaks for himself, Chris. Are you separating yourself from that, sir? I've spoken, I've made my own comments as to our values as well in a speech I gave to the State Department this past week. Mr. Secretary, thank you. Thanks for coming today. Always a pleasure to talk with you, sir. My pleasure, Chris. Stay safe. And let's hope those folks and friends, family in Texas stay safe. Keep them in your prayers. Yep, you bet. I think that's disgusting, actually. However, when asked about the State Department, it was a very different story from Secretary Tillerson. America's values are commitment to freedom, our commitment to equal treatment of people the world over, and that message has never changed. I don't believe anyone doubts the American people's values. It seems from that statement that while Tillerson is very willing to defend the State Department, he may be less enthusiastic about Trump. Either way, the president is planning to get to the bottom of this, so Tillerson may or may not be out soon. This is news worth knowing. This kind of stuff happened before Bannon and Priebus left too. So help share this to everyone and let Trump know what you think of Tillerson in the comments. Well, I'm very disturbed about Tillerson's answers because he made it quite clear when he's talking about the State Department he says the State Department. He didn't say the president's values. We the people voted for Trump. When he goes, when anybody goes against what Trump says, they're actually going against we the people. And that is, uh, th this is disgraceful. Disgraceful with the news and with Tillerson and whoever doesn't stick by President Trump. And President Trump was absolutely correct. He called out both sides because both sides were just as guilty and the UN has no business in our country 
making decisions for us and we should take down that 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 UN and dismantle it don't even donate any money to the UN that's it let me know what you guys think in the comments below and again thank you so much for watching